Yo, you know that's him on Bring Them Things. Facts, bro. You got to get that on. Are you recording? Bring Them Things. You hear that? That's the man behind the voice right there, man. Your boy, man. What's good? It's your boy, Harry Fraud. You tune in to Hot New Hip Hop. I mean, I think his impact on the game right now is literally everywhere. And, you know, whether people understand or not, I think the kind of melodic rapping that's occurring now, you know, that's his baby. You know what I'm saying? Whether it's, I mean, obviously Wiz says it all the time, but, you know, Drizzy, any, any, you know, a- anyone that, that is kind of hitting those melodic sing-song pockets you know, that is his, it's his direct stamp. And then on top of that kind of the like lush, atmospheric production style of picking that kind of thing. And you know, like Max would fucking rap on like, (laughs) do you remember the American boy beat? How crazy. (laughs) Like, he bodied that. You know what I'm saying? Like, things like that. Like, I think, you know, obviously the vocal style, but also what people are picking, I think, can be lent to Max, too. And, but, you know, it's funny because, obviously, he's moving more towards being free now. Excuse me. And I think that, just like with anything, the second... He's back out here. Everybody will act as if he was influencing them the whole time. Which he was influencing them the whole time. But yeah, you know how kind of, you know how the industry works. And that's, I don't think that's a negative thing. Because I think as long as he gets his props, he gets his props. You know what I'm saying? And, but I do think that it's important, he should be held on a certain level, which I obviously hold him on, and I think a lot of people do hold him on this certain kind of demigod level. You know what I'm saying? Half half human, half god. (laughs) Oh, 100%. They just listen to Wiz. 100%. And I do think there are the people that give up, that give it up to him and give him his props. I don't think it's like something where it's like they're not giving him his props. But I mean, obviously, unfortunately, Throughout history, in art, oftentimes the greatest influencers are not the ones that are necessarily recognized in the forefront. And I think that won't happen with Max because I think he'll come out and fucking smash with music. And that's all that, because, you know, like, he's, he has the gift. And it's not anything anyone can take away. That's a gift. You can mimic something. You can... But when you have the God-given gift, no one can take that from you. So I think that he'll get back out and sh- just fuck the whole world up. Like, that's, I firmly believe that, you know? I feel like Definitely free max. Like, like a Lord Infamous, where it's like everyone's on this triplet flow and they'll cite the Migos, the Migos, but it's like, well... Look Lord back, Infamous like, was rapping in triplets like, for a very long like, time. Yeah. yeah. And, but again, that's not the Migos' fault. Like, meaning that's not anyone that, anyone that's influenced by Max B, it's not, that, this is not a, a, to discredit them or, or downplay them in any way. It's just, that's just how it goes, I mean, man. Think about they're how many, like they, they exactly, them. but, and, and just think about how many ball players got their move from somebody they saw on West 4th. Think about, you know what I mean? Like, in anything. It just and everything is the wave now. Like literally everything anyone talks about is the wave and our wave and wavy and boom 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 and this does not exist without that man. You know what I'm saying? So.